Clean it up. Oh yeah. Cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. <coughs> Whoa, Julian Hernandez joined. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what up? What's up everyone? Thanks for joining in. Finished spraying the block wall. We did the uh, fence panels at the beginning of the week. And uh, I'm gonna clean up my pump. So typically I take my pump through three rinses. Uh, so the first thing I wanna do is pull the pump, pull it out of the paint. So, We'll remove the strong bag. So I'm going to lift the suction hose out of the paint and I'm going to turn it to bleeder so I can So now all of the paint that was in the bleeder in the main suction hose should be out of the hose. I'll just set that over. Yeah, in my bucket of water. This is my first rinse. So this is where I clean the hose. Now, <clears throat> there's quite a bit of paint left in the hose, so I want to make sure that I get that out of the hose. So I'm going to switch this to the hose and pull the trigger. until the paint is all the way out and some water starts to come through. Now I like to spray it on the side of the bucket. This way I can tell when the water starts to push through the hose. done with my paint bucket so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put the lid back on this and I'm pretty much done with that so all of my paint is out of the rig now it's just dirty water so I'm gonna do a second rinse all right so same thing with the second rinse you basically want to drain all this dirty water outside of the hose
to see the waters running clear. So we can remove the, uh, the wand. Pretty much done with that. Okay. So now I'm going to do my final rinse. Let's get this water out of the way here. This is the now on my final rinse, I like to put some paint cleaner in the water. Um, in this case, I'm using Pretty Boy. So just going to spray a few squirts in there. This way I got some soapy water running through the machine. Now that the pump is clean, I'm going to clean my tips and then I'm going to clean my filter. So I also got a nice little wire brush. Um, you could also pick this up at Pretty Boy. Um, I'm just going to clean my housing. Once I've cleaned my housing, I put it back on the spray gun. Hey. Put the tip back in. I'm going to spray. All right, then reverse it. Spray out the back. One more time out the front. All right. So my tip and my housing are clean. Next, I'm going to clean the filter and the gun. Real easy. I remove my guard and the top. As long as I release the pressure. Okay, you want to release the pressure. The top should just come off easily, hand tight. Okay, take the top off. And I want to check this. Okay, so I don't even have a filter in here. If you can get me one. Yeah, yeah. Um, where the are the... Ones, they're in the drawer, the top drawer in, yeah. the, in the trailer. So uh, I didn't have a filter in here. However, I'm going to replace but put a filter in here. Uh, sometimes when spraying thicker paints, I uh, don't use a filter. It makes it easier for the paint to flow. Okay, while we're waiting for that filter, I can clean out this filter here. Same thing here. This is going to be hand tight. Oh boy, what's going on? Last one. Can you grab the uh, channel locks? Yeah. Okay, so we got the uh, filter here that's going to go into the gun. Okay, so you always want to put it in. So that the little, uh, so that this is facing upwards. 
because this is going to sit right here in the gun just like so. Slide it in, screw it back on, hand tight until you can anymore. That's it. Put the guard in back in its place. And uh, this filter is now a clean filter. Here. I like to take the filter out. What's up? So there you have it. And that's how you clean your pump. Once again, appreciate you uh, watching. Be sure to subscribe and hit the uh, notification button so that you can be notified anytime I upload videos. Have a great day.